Hey, what's going on everybody? Your boy DJ City Manos. And in this video, I'm going to show you a real quick tutorial on how to do a monogram. I'm doing a monogram for um, graduation party. So I was looking for some artwork and I saw this one. This has both the diploma and the cap. I want to use this one. So the very first thing I did, I'm going to download this. I did a right click and I saved the image. I already saved it. So it should be in my download um, box. So next, I'm going to use GIMP. It's a software. It's free. I like it. Um, it's pretty cool. It's a free software. It's almost like Power... Uh, what is the other one called? I forgot the other one. But anyways, it's just like... You could do all kind of little designs and artwork on here. So let's get my artwork. It should be under Download. And it should be this one right here. Um... There's another image right here that I kind of like, but this one is a little better because it's thicker. Um, here, let me show you something. Real Hold on. Yeah, let me show you something. So this one right here is good, but look at the lines are thin. And I want to use some. I mean, it's going to be a monogram, so I want it a little thicker. And that's why I kind of like this one because it's pretty thick. See that? The white. So I'm going to use this one right here. And... If you guys know for the monogram, I want the background to be black. I want the background to be black and the letters white. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to um, change the colors. I'm going to reverse the colors. I'm going to invert it. So now this is what I want. And then another thing, I want this tassel to be on the left side. Because I'm going to put, I'm going to put this on the first letter. So I'm going to flip this over. So we're going to click on this right here. It says reverse the layer. And then we're going to click on the image. That's the way I want it. So I'm going to save two of them. I'm going to save two images. So I'm going to do a cap and then a diploma. Okay. So let's uh, let's go ahead and do the, the cap first. Let's save this. Uh, it's going to be a export as. I'm going to call it a cap. And let's call it diploma, whatever. And let's put switch the changes to your image, your pictures. And let's uh, we're gonna save this as diploma export. And then I'm gonna save another one as a cap. So I want to get rid of the diploma. So we're gonna get my marker, and we're gonna get rid of this right here, the diploma. So let's get rid of this right here. So now I'm just going to have a diploma and I'm going to have a cap. Two different images. So we're good. Now we're going to save this as a export as. You know, before I export it, I want to do something else. Um, okay, let's do that. Let's export this as a cap. And it's going to be under pictures. So we're going to bring in the diploma again. We're going to go ahead and uh, delete this image. Go ahead and delete this image. Delete image. And we're going to in, bring in the new uh, the, the diploma. I'm going to get rid of the cap on that one. Oh, whatever happened to my... Uh... Hold on, let's do this again. It didn't undo. Um, what happened to my images? It should be under pictures now. Here it is, my diploma. I want to get rid of the cap. I'm going to do the same thing and just color this all black. There's two different ways I could have done this, but that's fine right here. There's the different ways you could do stuff. Like I could have just cut the image out and crop it and save it as an image. Well, it's all good. So, we got the diploma isolated. We got the cap isolated. Now, I'm going to replace this one right here. The cap. Replace it. All right. Let's close this. And we're going to open up a whole new one. We could just say file uh, new. No, 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 no. Let's close it again. Let's just close it. This car. This. All right. Let's open up a whole new one. Let's open up GIMP again. 
And the reason why I close it because when you open, you start a new uh, new job. It has uh, this right here already saved for you. Watch, create new or new. I like this right here. 1920, 10 by 80. I couldn't remember that, so I, <laughs> that's why I said just close it. So now I want the background to be black. So let's go ahead and change the background black. Let's throw in my images in there. Let's throw in the cap first. Where's my cap? Oh man. I didn't uh all right. I guess I got to get rid of the diploma on this one. Let's get rid of the diploma. <laughs> Uh, where's my paintbrush? All right, let's get rid of this. Okay. I didn't uh, save it or did it right the last time. So now that we got my diploma, my cap, let's move this. You know, I want to do something in the cap. Um, let's move this over to the side for now. So we're going to click on this where it says move tool and we're going to move this over right there. That's good. All right. Now we're going to bring in our fonts, um, our text. So we're going to click on text and yeah, this is the font I want at Tekka and I want the letters to be white. So you go to the colors and I want it to be white and it's at Tekka. So we're going to put a box right here. We're going to put our fonts right here. And the girl that's graduating, her name is Deandra. So we're going to go ahead and type D and Andra. Make sure I spelled it right. Let me see. Let me look at her phone. I texted her earlier and I asked her about her name. So it's D Deandra. Okay, perfect. So now this font, I want it bigger than that. So let's go ahead and change the size to the font. Where's the size at? Here it is. Let's make it bigger. Keep going bigger, 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 bigger. Boom. Okay, perfect. And we're going to do it right there. Boom. A little bit more. Okay, so that's perfect right there. And I'm going to go ahead and create another text. And this one's going to say class of 20, um, class of uh, 2021. So let's go ahead and do another text. And this one's going to say class of 2021. So we're going to type in class of 2021. Oh, dang, this one's huge. So we got to change the size on this one. So let's go in ahead and highlight this. And we're going to change the size to until it fits in the box. There it is. Go a little higher. Right. Until I lose a one. I don't know why I picked this font. Um, I kind of liked it. I was searching for fonts. And uh, I came across this one. I said, hmm. So we're going to try that. See this right here? The old 20. That's supposed to be a space right here. So if you get rid of this and you put a space, come up with the old 20. So what I'm going to do is get rid of that. I could either put a comma or a dot to get rid of it so i'm gonna do a dot for now and this zero the zero is weird i could put zero and it has that weird zero or i could put a an o and the o looks better so we're gonna leave with the o so to get rid of this dots i'm gonna get my paint my marker and i'm gonna have it black and i'm gonna just paint this oops <laughs> undo I could just leave it like that. I want to do undo. Let's just change the color right here. There it is. And then we just paint it black. That's how you fix that. So now we have class of 2021. Now, 
the cap. I'm going to fix the cap. So the cap, if you notice, I want to make it seem like the D is wearing the cap. So I have an idea for that. And I want to put a diploma right here, either laying on the A or doing something on the A. So we could bring in the, the diploma. Let's go back to the images and let's grab this diploma. Let's drop it in. And I want the diploma to be right here. So we could either rotate it a lot. We could get, get it here and just rotate that sucker. Just or I say like this is perfect. So we could rotate and then from there I could get this uh, thing to move it over right here. Now if you notice that this diploma is covering the letters in the back, that is because this right here, it says cap class Andrea or Andrea Deandra and diploma this, this this her name should be way the first one it should be the first one so you put it in the first one now it's like layers you want the name to be on top and the diploma to be in the background so now that that's like that is I'm gonna move this over a little bit or I can make the the, the fonts a little bit smaller so go ahead we're gonna um, click on text this right here, the text. And we're going to highlight her name. And let's make it a little bit smaller. We have 600. Let's go keep going small. About right there. And yeah, that's perfect. And let's move it over to the left. It's just a little bit. Oops. <laughs> what I do. Hit undo, undo, undo. Okay, so since that didn't work right here, just move it over and move it over a little bit. And I need to raise up that the diploma a little bit higher. So click on the diploma next right here. I'm f not the diploma, the, hey, oh, I rename, oh, that's right, that's right. I got some goofy names. I got it reversed. I got cap and diploma. Okay, let's raise the the, the this right here. <laughs> I know what I'm doing though. You like DJ City Models, man? You're confusing, bro. You're all over the place. So if I had a line here, I could see if it's lined up. So let's do this. I don't have a line. Let's get this. I want to put this right here. Yep, we are lined up. What I'm doing? Oops. What I was doing? I was I was getting the to see if it looks good and we look good so it's gonna be like that deandra see the class of 2020 this low so let's click let's focus on that now class of 20 and we're gonna click on text and then we're gonna what happened what happened oh whatever i lost a zero the dots because i remember i colored it so we're gonna raise this up higher is that right i can make it black again And we're going to go a little higher. And we're going to look at that and see how that looks. Does it look pretty good? It looks pretty good to me. It looks good to me. So now I want to make it, I, may, I want to make the D it look like it's wearing the cap. So I'm going to tilt the cap a little bit, but... I want to make this deeper, like a deeper cap, because it's, it's too narrow. From here to there, it's too narrow. See, like this one? Where my image is at? Um, let me show you the other cap I had. See how deep it is? I want to make it, like, a little bit deeper. You see what I'm talking about right now? Watch. You're going to see what I'm talking about, because I want to make it seem like it's wearing it. And if I stop right here, this this cap is we weird. Yeah, let's do that. Let's focus on the on the on the cap. Well, it's in this case, I got it all reversed, so it should be diploma. <laughs> oh man, your boy DJ City Manos. 
So what I want to do, I want to bring this down right here. Let me see, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Let's try that. Let's see if I could do something. I want to do something. Um, let's see if I could. What I'm trying to do, I want to make it deeper. Like, start right here, come across. So I'm going to see if I could do that. So let's rotate this. Let's see if I could rotate this. No, I can't. So the next thing, what I'm going to do is rotate the cap. Um... Forget it. Forget that thing. Let's scratch that plan out. Let's, let's rotate the cap. Click on the cap. Oh, it is rotating. My bad. About right there. So I want to get this thing right here. And let's move it over. Let's see if it works. I think I rotated too much. See, so what I want to do, I want to do it like this. Yeah, I think I rotated it too much. Let's hit undo. Hit it undo. So let's rotate this. Um, is it perfect? I think that's that's the way I want it. So what I want, I want to do something like this. A little bit deeper. Like about right here. Hmm. I gotta go. I gotta rotate it some more. So let's uh, hit undo and let's rotate some more. You like what? You guys, what are you doing, DJ City Manos? This is what I want to do. I want to make it deeper, the cap, just like that. All right, let's try that. So I'm gonna do a, 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 a anchor. That means I put it back. So let's make this black. Watch, watch, you see what I'm talking about. Let's make this, uh, where my paint, my paintbrush. Paintbrush, and let's make all this black. Okay, and let's make this. There you go. Actually, that's fine. I think, I think that's good right there. Let's see. Um, let's bring in the other ones back in. And I want I wanted to make it seem like he's wearing the D, the cap. I mean, the D is wearing the cap. Um, so let's rotate the cap. So now we, let's click on the cap and let's rotate that sucker in an angle. Like about right there. Rotate. A little bit more. Rotate. Boom. I think that the cap is a little too big. So let's make it a little bit smaller. Let's make it a little bit. Let me see. Let me look at it. Yeah, I think the cap is a little bit too big. So let's go ahead and let's shrink the cap a little bit smaller. And just a little bit of this. 
All right, then we're going to position this cap right there. There you go. Now, it's coming together. It's coming together. Now, I want to get rid of you can, If you see there's two different whites, let's go to uh, 400. You can see what I'm talking about. Let's look at the D. There's two different whites. So I want to get rid of this right here. So I'm going to have to click on our name and I'm going to erase all this. So we're going to get the eraser. Where's the eraser at? And then we're going to get rid of all this. Right here, right here. So here goes where it gets. Let me see. Hold on. Let me do something real quick. Yes, like that. I'm gonna make it make it seem like the D is wearing the the cap. So I'm just going down the line, getting rid of all that white. Actually, they're not supposed to be all the way down here. Yeah, my bad. It's supposed to be right here. Oh, it's coming together. It's coming together. All right, we're going to look at it right now and see what it looks like. All right, let's make it big or small and we can see what it looks like. There you go. Now it looks like she's wearing, it looks like the D is wearing the cap. It's coming together. So now... I like that. I think I'm done. What do you guys think? I think I'm done. I just need to. Uh, oh, 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 oh! I'm not done. I gotta get rid of the dots. Actually, you know what? Let's raise this. I'm trying to. Let's raise this a little higher. So class of, go to text, and we're gonna raise this just a little bit. Just a little bit higher, right there. And I'm gonna have to drop down the the her name down a little. Let's 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 make this a little bigger, just a little bit. Keep going until I, I lose the one. Keep going, keep going, keep going. No, I'm not gonna lose the one. <laughs> there you go. Go drop it a little smaller. Just a little bit. Right there. I think I'm doing. I'm looking at the. Uh, it looks nice. Actually, this needs to go a little higher. Or this needs to go a little higher. Let's go ahead and make this a little bit higher. And you're like, why are you making it higher, DJ City Models? Because what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to get this the same down here the same as the top and i don't have a a, a, a grill a, a scale or not a scale i do have one let me see tools we have a where is it at measure let me see layers a scale layer i think it's a scale no let me see is it scale it was something else. Let me see. If I can't find it, oh well. Tools. I think it was scale. Anyways, it's, it's all good. Grid. There we go. Grid. Show grid. So right here we have a grid now. And what the grid does... Um, if you go to, um, if you come over here to, um, let's put it back on a hundred. I don't know, a 50. 
if you see on the left side it says from zero so you could have an idea of where the letters begin so like you could put the mouse right here and on the left side let me see so this is 250 this is uh, what's half of 251 Oh well, I'm good. <laughs> I'm just gonna eyeball it. Get rid of the grid. Show grid. Where's the grid at? Get rid of the grid. I'm just gonna eyeball it. So that looks pretty much good. So let's get rid of these dots. So we're gonna get my click on uh, class of 21, and I'm gonna get my marker, my paintbrush. Make sure it's black, and let's color it. And I am done. I am done. Oh. Now I am done. Make sure her name is correct again. Before I save it. Deandra. So now there's two things I want to do le uh, now. I'm going to save this. I want to make it into a movie clip. So. To do a movie clip. I'm trying to, I'm seeing something real quick. It's because I'm a perfectionist. I gotta be perfection. I'm looking at the, I'm looking at the D again. I'm one of those uh, guys who just, when I say I'm done, I'm not really done. 400. I'm looking at the D right here. See, I was looking at this right here. You know what? Let's, let's do that. Let's make it a little bit more better. Let's fix that. Um, see, this white is to me, for me, is off still. So let's fix that. Oops. <laughs> Undo. Edit. I want the eraser. Um. Now let's do this undo. I went too much. I want about right here. And what I'm doing, I'm erasing some more of the white. Because to me, it looks... I could still see it with my eyeballs. And... Like I said, I'm one of those weird guys who just can just leave it at that. Now, watch this. Let's go back to 50. There you go. Now it kind of looks like it's wearing it a little bit. Let's go to... Boom. It looks good to me. Class of 2021. So let's save this. Let's export this as. We're going to call this. Uh, Deandra. Let's call this Deandra 1. Export. What did I save it at? I wasn't paying attention. Documents. Cancel. I don't want to go document. I want to go in pictures. Export. Okay, so now here I'm gonna go to GIMP or not GIMP, uh, Bluff type title, and I'm gonna do a file new, and I'm gonna get rid of this. Get rid of this. I don't need that. I'm gonna just put the picture in. So where's her picture at? Where's her picture? There it is, right here. I'm gonna drag it in. I wonder if it works in drag in. No. If it didn't work, then we're going to add the picture. Add picture layer. And we're going to bring in her picture in. The one I just did. And what I want to do. 
I wanna I'm gonna say two twenty. Two two. All right. So what I want to do, I want to um. See, I'm eyeballing it too. I'm positioning. I'm moving it to the center. So I think that's the center right there. So what I want to do, I want to make this into a video. See, when I hit play, it's going to play it. And it's playing it for four seconds. I'm going to change the, 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 the length of it. And I'm going to change it to, um, let's say, right now it's at four seconds. Let me make it 10 seconds. And stretch it. So now when I will hit play, it's gonna play. It's like a movie is playing in the back, and I'm gonna put. I'm gonna play it, cause I'm not gonna have a slideshow or anything. So I just want this one playing, looping each other uh, for a long time. So I'm done with this one. I'm gonna export as video, and it's gonna export to videos. Save. Oh. Andrew. I'm done. And then from here, I'm going to go to Virtual DJ. And I'm going to go to Virtual DJ. And we're going to play it. And Virtual DJ, so I don't have anything hooked up to it. So let's go to um right here. I'm going to grab it, and where is that? It should be under videos. Where's my videos at? And um, Deandra, right here. Drag that suck up in there. And then from there, I'm going to go edit. And we're going to, we're going to, um, we're going to um, loop it. And then we're going to go over here and, and try to save the image as a load image file or use. And then we're going to save that puppy. So now when you hit play, it's just repeating itself all night long. You just have this on the projector. Just have that on the projector playing all night long. It looks. I'm gonna get the projector right now. <laughs> uh, see what it looks like. But basically, I'm done. Class of 21. All right, this is your boy DJ City Manos, and uh, I'm sure this was a long video. I don't know how long it was, but let's see. Let's see. Let's see how long it was. We're gonna check and see. Um, 30 minutes. All right, I'm out. Thanks for watching. Peace.